socks in my boat shoes. Guess a nigga eating good like Whole Foods. Not a couple cameras, now they bring the whole crew. Bad bitch riding with me, so she posed too. See me and my guys like a plane flown through. Hella high, rolling weed up like I'm supposed to. And now I'm in the big thing. On the building, you need to know the tenant rate. Getting paid, still riding no shirt. Let a bitch give me brain, call it homework. Niggas try hating on them, but it a don't work. Shit done change. No clothes, no cars, no fame. Uh, them same boys that used to be at the bottom came up, that's what they say. Used to not be allowed in the building, but now we on the rooftop. Used to not be allowed in the building, but now we on the rooftop. Slow money's just bad as getting no money. But learn to get good show money, that's your money. Get comfortable with it, really no money. Rich nigga shit, that really goes for me. Self-made nigga, well played. I'm on a plane drinking champagne and lemonade. You try and copy what's been done, I'm trying to innovate. And club owners getting tired of trying to ventilate. Big mistake. I'm too busy finding places and trips to take. The more I smoke, the more money my business make. Remember, they used to be like, who is this? Now I'm up in this bitch. They light up like Independence Day. When you around the real, you keep it real every day. My niggas keep it real, so I hear what they say. Either you getting paid or you paying to play. Either you on your grind or you stay out the way. A lot okay. of shit done changed. No clothes, no cars, no fame. No fame. Them same boys that used to be at the bottom came up, that's what they say. Used to not be allowed in the building, but now we on the rooftop. Used to not be allowed in the building, but now we on the rooftop. Uh, just made a million, got another million on my schedule. The piss up on my Ferrari, you jet, so you jealous. You niggas ain't help us on second thought, you did. They hating was the fuel for this shit, so you wrote your own check, old ho ass. Hello, hello, hello. Sorry, my mic just decided to like stop working for a second. Y'all, I am literally so fucking excited for this. Okay, let's, I think we should just get right into it, honestly. But I fucking love this game. I fucking love this game so much. <sighs> okay, so also... In the meantime, while we load this bitch up, while we load this sucker up, I have I have banned myself from watching Moist Critical videos because they just always end up like triggering me and I'm just like, I need to stop. Like, it's getting a little bit too personal. It's hitting a little bit too close to home. Why does my nose look so crooked? Okay, I kind of like fixed it a little bit. <laughs> Just the music is getting me so fucking hype. Oh my god, I forgot we left off right here. Oh my god. Fucking Brave New World. I can't wait to see more Frank. I fucking love Frank. Previously, on Life is Strange. Might take this off a little bit. I can't believe Firelock is playing a show at the old mill. I'm gonna teach this little punk some manners. Sorry if that screwed the desktop audio a little bit. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here, Curtis. Get the fuck out of here. I see you slipping. Respect me. Hello, Black Hell. Chloe, do something! Hey, do you know if Rachel is a gamer? <gasps> How would oh you my god. To join Literally, me? she looks so iconic in that fit. Don't be surprised, Chloe. If one day I'm just out of here, let me know if you need an accomplice. Damn, they are really going at it. 
You remember that guy that we saw Excuse. under this tree with that woman? That was my dad. And that woman was definitely not my mom. That woman was definitely not her mom, you guys. Okay, let me put on some lipstick real quick. I'm back. Did you guys miss me? Miss Price, how good of Oh my god. Choose. Is this about I'm them so skipping or is this about the forest fire the that they started? Just, sorry. I think it might be about the forest fire that they started. Let's proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other is all too familiar Excuse. with it. Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. When that conducive to education reality and enrichment. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel. She's wearing the Rachel, same shirt two days in a row. Rachel really did start that. Fire. I mean, no tea, no shade. And that Some shit I would do back in the day. agreed to run away from here. Right? Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? Um, what? <laughs> Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was broken. Do you recall what that was? Um. I would say nothing. Realistically, I would say nothing. No. Let me refresh your memory. We agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. We did. In the event that you were unable or unwilling to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the Academy. Despite all this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday in subordinate language when did that happen oh in bullying nathan prescott no i stood up for that little weirdo i suppose that's one interpretation of events say what you will about my daughter but she is not a bully she's still wearing the apron iconic Maybe you should be talking to drew instead of me you know the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of? Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. And Chloe's situation is less sensitive? I do not discuss That's because, um... We are here to discuss your... The guy that she just called out for bullying actions. Nathan, his dad Indeed. lost his job, and it's the Prescott's fault. Where's your mom? That's mom, my mom right no, there. This is all bullshit, right? I'm beginning to suspect that myself. I am sorry you feel that way, but your daughter's misbehavior is real and serious. And yet, even with your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price, we needn't discuss any of it. We needn't. We needn't. <laughs> no, because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. What does that mean? It means you forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to- I made her do it. What? 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 Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a bad Shouts day. to her for accepting I responsibility. I steam, and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. But I wouldn't listen. See- Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with me, but only to keep me safe. I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe, that you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? Of course. Yeah, sure. Very cool. Thank you. I'll make it up to you. I she is a great A bullshitter. Chloe. Is this true? Shouts to her, That's though. True. Totally not true. 
She really is an amazing actress. Miss See, I was just thinking that myself. Uh... Yeah, fine. Fine, yes. It was her idea, but it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. I think that's the best Ms. response Amber, I could have chose. Based on what you've just chosen. told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? Yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. Ray. Just to be clear, Miss Amber. Rachel Ray. Are you sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you or coerce her? Coerce her. To the bottom of Bitch, coerce well, her. We're clear, Principal Wells. I hardly know Some her. Like Rachel, but not my daughter. Excuse this is the one time where that actually applies. Coerce her. I hardly know her. A list of students you assume the worst about. Um, I'm just gonna enjoy the show. You have no right to treat Chloe this way. This is because she's on financial aid, isn't it? Let's all just calm down. After every it's because I'm gay, isn't it? She's been no, it's because I'm trans, isn't it? Years. No, it's she okay. Let's just be honest. Person. It's because I'm trans. Miss Price. Mrs. Price. Mrs. Price. I appreciate your position, but I assure you, it is only your daughter's past behavior that has led us here today. I understand, Mr. Wells. There is no doubt that Chloe's behavior must improve. But given what we've just learned about the negative influence she was under, I hope you will allow her just one more chance. Miss Amber. Yo, her hair kind of looks like uh, a wig that we have on Bimbaland. Oh, also, speaking of, bitch, I'm prime Zimbo on Bimbaland now, so. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. Yeah. But you have squandered our trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance of The Tempest. Damn. <sighs> Yo, I'm so fucking hungry. I'm literally so fucking hungry. I might get a little bit bite to eat. back I got some Cheetos just because there was like there's only like a couple Cheetos left in here when I came back my cat was like she was looking at me and she was like like her her paws were like <sighs> like so far apart um are you insane what? are you insane your discipline is to attend to Miss Price. Right. She loves that show. Since this is her first infraction, Mr. Amber, I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. He's the district attorney? There's the a fuck? Reason we have understudies for all circumstances, accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria Chase. Yes. I'm sure Victoria Chase. No fucking you. shot. That is such What was that, Miss Price? No fucking Chloe way. Is upset for her friend, but we not Victoria Chase, bro. Not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. 
There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next. Unless you have something to add first, Miss Price. Oh, back talk! Back talk! No way is Rachel missing the play for me. But thanks to her acting skills, I'll have to go down in flames if I want to fix this. Okay. Head out of your ass, Wells. Chloe, <laughs> you seriously think yesterday was a little Miss Sunshine's idea? Miss Amber has accepted her responsibility. I'm sad. You are unacceptable, bitch. You're punishing her for taking the blame for me, for trying to be a good person, that makes you even more clueless than I thought. Rachel confessed. Are you calling her a liar? I ain't calling you a truther. I confess she can act. I confess to thinking she can act like a motherfucker. You just bought her crap. Hook, line, and sinker. You don't have to do this. It's okay. Really. Um. You do you. How about you don't take credit for my shit? You don't see me claiming I did my homework, do you? Because that's your stupid thing. Chloe, this can't be you. Apologize this instant. Apologize to my ass. Fine. Mr. Wells, <gasps> I'm sorry for exposing the flaws in your campus security. Bitch. I've heard enough. These cheetos are tiny at this point. Rachel, you were clearly trying to cover for your classmates. I appreciate the motive, but I appreciate honesty more. Is that understood? Yes, sir. You will not be removed from the play. But now we're gonna be Was fucking expelled. So Thank you. And Miss Price. I came into today's meeting planning to suspend you for the rest of the school year with a chance for reinstatement in the fall. And now? You are expelled. <gasps> what the fuck? What? No. I will have Skip Matthews escort you to clean out your lock. You may wait outside my office. That is fucked up. That is all. Good day, Mrs. Price. Mr. and Mrs. Amber. Ray. Come on, Chloe. Now I kind of regret that. No, I kind of regret that. Because, like, what the fuck? Because Rachel literally started a fucking forest fire. She deserved to be kicked out of the play. I didn't get the chance to introduce myself. I'm Joyce. Mrs. Price. I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry. No, this is really weird, you guys. No, I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. We really should be going. Nice to meet you. Mom. Um... I'll see you in the parking lot. Hey, Chloe. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me, A eh, Skip. You know I was supposed to have today off, right? Sorry, but my totally fair and impartial hearing inconvenienced you. Man. I mean, it was fair. I just screwed it up for you. Sorry, Clo. Sorry, Clo, Clo. I don't really care about any of this shit, except my secret stash. I might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. I'm so sorry if this spot is unwatchable, by the way. Trash the homework. We ain't gonna need it now. <gasps> Kitty! That is so cute! 
I want one. I mean, I already have like six, but I want that one. Sign. Almost. We're one away. Does anybody understand that reference? I'm not going to explain it. I think that was returnable. One after the other, bitch. Retrieve. Jackpot. Put it in the mm. pencil case. What the hell? Damn it, Justin. Chloe, hey -o, I had to borrow your stash des desperate times, you know. I promise I'll get you back next week, Justin. Fuck every inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling. But with Skip watching me. Uh, bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool? <sighs> okay. But try to make it fast, will you? Realistically, they wouldn't say try to make it fast. And realistically, security wouldn't watch you clean out your locker. Subordinate Kid Bouncer Women take forever to get ready, David. <gasps> oh my god, there will be consequences, Max. putting a lot of trust into that sink. I mean, not gonna lie, whenever I was like in sophomore year, I like took a picture like uh, holding my phone and then like my leg on the sink like that. Kind of fucking iconic if you ask me. Love. Sorry, I'm a little bit drunk. No pool stream today. No pool stream today. It's very cloudy. It's very cloudy. We are playing Life is Strange. Victoria was fucking shook. Kitty. I just wanted to hold her. What the fuck? Now my mom and David are having a conversation, bro. What the hell, bro? Later, Skip. Later. It truly would be later. Looks like David's here. Awesome. Okay, I'm trying to just read all of this. Trolley sweep got Wells tomorrow morning. Yeah, my fault. Worth it. Wells blows. That meeting hella sucked. You're hella weird. You are. Seriously, it's okay. Yesterday was worth it. See, I fucking regret that. Fire weather update. Arcadia Bay Forest Watch. Active Class D wildfire not contained. Use caution. Check local media for road closures. 
We text Mr. Wells? Oh, it's like an automatic thing. Members of the Blackwell community, please be advised that a fast-moving wildfire has recently been sighted in the vicinity of, the, of Culmination State Park. I have spoken with the Arcadia Bay Forest Watch who do not believe any evacuations are necessary at this time as the Blackwell campus is not within the affected area or the fire's current projected path. Please utilize caution while traveling to and from campus. Faculty and staff have been asked to waive punctuality requirements for all sports and extracurricular activities this weekend. Elliot says, yeah, I'm just in my room. Hey, after Tempest, do you want to hang out? I wish I could text them back. They should have, like, AI embedded into video games where you can, like, oh, well, I mean, they already do, but, like, where you can, like, text them and stuff like that, and they'll respond, like, in character. Thank goodness. Come home by curfew. We have that meeting early tomorrow. Again, Chloe, really? Chloe, you can't keep doing this to me. I'm trying my best. Poor mom, dude. Poor mom. Is the forest fire still going on? Yep. I'm blocking it. Okay, look at that. Bigfoot head. Taking pride in Blockwell athletics means taking pride uh. in yourself. Also, the trustees and their enormous bank accounts. Why is the skateboard in the trash? At least I'll have a. Uh, Plenty of free time to take up skateboarding again. If I feel like it. It's about damn time. David, please. David, please. David, please. David, police. Your mother and I have been talking. Jesus died for our Cynthia's. Can we please do this later? I kind of don't want to hear from David about all this shit. And who do you expect to handle things for you? Your mother? <laughs> I don't what about my mom, bro? You wanna go, bro? Sergeant Asshat here. I just need some space. Do Damn, not we kinda use that went off. with your mother. She's my mother. If my mother has something to say, she will say it to me. She has. The problem is, you don't listen. Maybe if you try listening to me. Instead of fighting me about everything, you might actually learn a thing or two. What? Not with that haircut, How bro. Soldier? Soldiers put family and future above self and now. Getting kicked out of school? That's what losers do. You had a yeah, I mean, I wish we hadn't gotten kicked out of school, but, you know. What kind of opportunity you gave up? Do you want to work at the diner? Someone needed my help. Someone needed my help. Who? Your friend Rachel? Because I think the daughter of the DA is going to be just Okay, damn. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I tried my best. Me. I'm just a people mother. pleaser. We I'm need to sorry. Get our own house in order. Right now what I need most of all is for the two of you to start getting along. Chloe, I care about Joyce very much. They're so cute to together. For the incident they don't even know that we kind of like started the if wildfire. You improve your attitude going forward. Incident? What incident? Chloe was incredibly out of line. She insulted me, swore at me. But with an apology, I'm willing to start over. I'm willing to apologize. Sure. Sure. Reset button pressed. I am glad to hear it. From now on, it's kind of a dick, but like. Your mother in a few areas. You know, I'm Making trying to like sure not cause problems. No I didn't even want to get kicked out. Using drugs or alcohol. If I had thought it through, I wouldn't have taken the blame. I don't even think I really knew what I was doing by taking like the blame. Empty your pockets and place all your belongings on the trunk of the car. What the fuck? If we are going to start over, we have to know that you are not abusing drugs. If you're not, you should be eager for the chance to prove it. Mom. 
I mean, I aren't we not abusing drugs because our stash drugs. was like taken know, by Chloe, Justin? And I'm sorry, but David feels Joyce. We feel this is the best way to start fresh. Let's go, Chloe. Quit stalling. Getting ready to back talk if I have to. Comply, we don't have anything on me. I don't have anything on me. We don't have anything on us. The fuck? Attitude, I see you. Doing it for no reason. You're awfully smug for someone who just got kicked out of school. Oh yeah, wasn't this game invented oh, wait, back sorry. whenever it was okay for 18 plus year olds, 18 year olds to smoke tobacco and nicotine? I forgive you. I forgive you. You were under a terrible influence. Okay, I'm just fair. worry about you. But that's no excuse. Fair, fair answer. Joyce, I should have expected, you know, now. there wouldn't be a whole lot of options that were that's expressing you, David. okayness we with David. We need to start treating each other better. And that means all of us. We need a new beginning. A new chapter. One that will involve the three of us together. Well, what does that mean? We both agree that the best thing for everyone at this stage is for me to move in. No! No fucking way. Chloe, after everything that's happened, I'm at a loss. I need help. So there's the chance that we did all of this, that we like started a new, that we apologized to him and he still decided to fucking surveil us? What the hell? I know I fucked up, but like, I, I'm sorry. I, I know I fucked up. I'm a fuck up. I'm sorry. Are you sorry? You don't even know what you're apologizing for. I've been shutting you out even though I've needed you and you need me and I know that. But this is not the answer. It's the only answer I have, Chloe. His eyebrows are low-key asymmetrical. In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. I'm sorry I took that for granted. I'm not choosing anyone over anyone else. It's about the three of us having a home together. It'll be better than you think, Chloe. Once everything's running smoothly, you'll see what a stable home can be like. Bruh. Is it gonna let me choose to get in? Not the red truck. Hey! There is no home. Not if he's there. Chloe. My mom would have tackled me, not gonna lie. She'll come home as soon as her tantrum is over. Where are we going? Because we can't go back into Blackwell. She's smoking a cig. How do you know which way is up? when your whole life has been turned upside down. You look behind you. Are we at the junkyard? Yup. Not the car that my dad died in. Blackwell's done with me. I can't go home anymore. 
You can always go home. You literally can always go home. Junkyard, all I've got left. Is this where they start hanging out in that little um cubicle? That little cube in the junkyard? Sorry, I'm literally so intoxicated right now. See, the first truly like wasn't hitting and then I was like, well, the second one, and then it's like really hitting. Okay, I'm gonna take a bathroom break really quick. So I will BRB right back. Do I have a BRB? I was starting soon screen. We'll choose that one. Okay, I'm back. We're all good, we're all good. The sun is starting to set, yay. But also, nay. Ugh. Me when I become a horse, yay, but nay. What is that, the battery? I'm gonna eat some Cheetos and try to like sober up a little bit. Maybe I can fix it. Forgive me if this is like the most heathen way of eating chips. First thing it needs is a new battery. Wonder if I can find one around here. Okay. Let's start like over here. I'm guessing we can't walk over the mannequin head. It's like a cornfield, or not a cornfield, but a corn maze. Yeah, it's like a corn maze. I always wanted a pet snake. Instead, you just follow the right hand favorite. side That's and then you'll get out. Or rather a hedge maze? I don't know. I don't know shit about cornfields, if I'm being honest.
this investigate. Won't work. Fuck. Fuck. What about this one? What are you trying to hide under there, Hood? Oh, there's a boot on it. Oh, there's a little latch right here. Awesome, amazing. We are doing so great, you guys. Here we go, the pick of the litter. Okay. I think it was over here. Fucking sleigh? God damn, that was close. Me when I don't have a car, so I just make one from the junkyard. Easy, easy money. the screwdriver we know it'll work because we watched the first one this thing needs more love than I can give right now okay me when I just meantime, lied apparently maybe I can spruce it up a bit Chloe Price I don't suck you really, really don't. My mom thinks I do. Do know if I can stand going home tonight. Still there? Grabbing something from home, then I'll meet you at junkyard. See you really soon. You better. Okay, what are we gonna do about the torn seeds? Excuse. While an escape hatch could be nice. I should probably cover over this massive hole. Okay, so we're fixing the carb in the meantime. I bet if I look, I can find something else to fix inside the truck. Oh. Maybe there's another light bulb I can put in here. Okay, okay. so... Let's see what else this trash heap has to offer. Find more to fix. Okay. Let's walk to the right again. I don't think a mannequin head will do us much good. I don't think the school bus will do us much good. Make it a great day. Make it a great day, you guys. <gasps> Light bulb! You might not work. Then again, I hardly ever work. Was that from... I wonder what that was that we just took it from. I would think you could find a light bulb in a refrigerator. You should cover that life-endangering floor hole quite nicely. Okay. What's the other thing that we're looking for? So it was the floorboard. Oh yeah. I want to see what this says. Wow. <laughs> Shitty ride, drug dealer. Really thought crime paid better. Narcotics. 
We're looking for something like a cloth or something to cover up the seat of the car. A beach this towel. Could cover that torn seat and look awesome doing it. Okay, we've got everything. We fucking got everything. Staying to the right actually works. Who knew? I love how we like don't have anything in our hands, but then suddenly whenever it comes time to fix it, we can fix it. That's actually so badass. Fix the floorboard. Okay, me whenever she texts me, kicking my feet up in the air. I love how we saw this truck and we were immediately like, that's it, like, that's mine. This thing looks like a rusted out shopping cart. It probably drives like one too. That's if it ever does drive. If it ever does it drive. questionable. Still, how sweet would that be? What's up? Yeah, just checking in to see how you do. Hey, Frank. Really? No. Listen, we've got some business to discuss. Where can we meet? What about? Oh, like drugs? Frank. I'm hanging out in the junkyard. Sorry, my Broke mom just texted me. The junkyard. That's great. Stay there. I'll see you soon. Okay. And Frank. Burner phone? That's an important okay, thing to know. Up. Are you going to smash your phone? Like, in the movies? And if so, can I smash it? Trust me, Price. If I ever have to smash anything, you'll want nothing to do with it. I'll see you. Damn. That's a badass cell phone, though, that we got. I want a flip phone like that. See, I've honestly considered just getting like a flip phone and an iPod. Time for and then like that would be perfect. Turn on. Does your truck look like an aquarium on wheels? Didn't think so. You only get one chance to make a first expression. She looks so innocent with her doe eyes. Mystical. Mystical. It's like me choosing between my Lilo No Stitches Instagram or um Excuse my finsta. Mystical or frightening? The eye sees all. <laughs> okay. Honk. Honk honk. Beep beep. How are we gonna do it? Are we gonna go beep or beep beep beep? The first option, or actually the second option that I said. Let's smoke. I'm gonna have a smoke break too with my Juicy Peach Ice Geek Bar. Forest fire still going on, causing thousands of damage. Cause Rachel Amber saw her dad kissing another woman.
Okay, me when I have many destructive qualities. Shit. I slept all day. Oh my god. What the hell? <gasps> Is the fire right up on us? Oh my god. Rachel. Rachel. Rachel, what's going down? You there? Or is she just a pyromaniac and this isn't even the forest fire? Huh, huh, hello? Hello? Dad? Oh, okay. She's seeing things, she's seeing ghosts, she's seeing demons. Are we roasting marshmallows? Are we roasting marshmallows? Marshmallows? I wonder if it burned like this the day... The day it happened. What do you think it was like in that recording studio whenever she was recording these uh, here? lines? <gasps> Beat the raven, the marcello. Speak. Uh, are you trying to tell me something? Are you trying to tell me something? Oh my God! I becometh the raven. Dad. He becometh the raven. He's a feathery. He's like a furry, but like with feathers. Dad. Ah, it's like that peanut butter baby. Yeah. Does it feel good? Ah. <laughs> I wonder if it. Okay, that's not what I meant to choose. The day, the day, day it happened. happened. Wait, that was kind of aesthetic. The way that it made me look. I wonder if it burned like this. If I'm just smoking day. crack, I don't know. Day it happened. Story time. One time I actually got like really fucking close to like doing drugs. Not doing drugs. Doing heroin. Yeah. Okay. Insanity. I miss him so much. Is it gonna give us a different result? Oh, we stabbed the marshmallow, duh. Instead of, does it feel good? Ah. Dad? Ah. Over and over again. Do you think that the stick makes the marshmallow taste better? I'm willing to bet that it does. <sighs> Still thinking about that, Raven? Dad? Ah. <sighs> I'm surprised it didn't say, never more. Isn't it? I can't look away. Sure. Don't pretend you're not This is so too. scary. 
don't pretend you're not mesmerized too. Scary. See, you're so drawn to it, you don't even realize the danger. It's a metaphor for Rachel. Danger? Fire blinds us, just like darkness. <laughs> but darkness blinds with absence, with loss. What does he's just smiling while he's fire. saying these lines. Beauty. Fire blinds the darkness. Beauty. Pain. But sometimes. But sometimes. There's a greater beauty. There's a greater come. beauty yet to come. Incredible. Fire is jealous, Chloe. It wants all the beauty for itself. That's why you need to be careful. Oh my god! What? You need to be careful! Get oh my fucking god! I was like making light of it and darkness, but I was making light of it. That shit was scary as fuck. Hasn't anyone ever told you not to fall asleep with a lit cigarette? Not this bitch being a hypocrite. Sorry. So, are you gonna invite me in, or what? I don't know. I'm not supposed to give rides to strangers. What if I promise you free candy? I think it's the Not other way around. Oh, they're running away. These Cheetos are so fucking good. Damn. You've been busy. It's nothing. Just some junk I found lying around. A rainbow towel? A freaky red light? Holy oh yeah, I forgot we're trying to make her our girlfriend. I <laughs> figured it can't hurt to have the Illuminati on our side for whenever shit goes down. Always thinking ahead. Chloe. This Galaxy brain maneuvers. I, I can't believe you found us an escape vehicle already. Escape? Like, for us to run away? The escape from LA. I, I guess I wasn't thinking about it that way. Are you getting cold feet? I thought you were all bye-bye Arcadia Bay last night. I still am. I guess. You guess? See, how does anybody That's have so that easy. much confidence as the this teenager? This doesn't even start, and we don't have any money. We can figure all of that out. I have no doubt. Besides, there's no rush. True. You know Blackwell. <sighs> Holy shit. That well's meeting. I'm so sorry. I can't believe he actually expelled you. Why not? No reason to prolong the inevitable. It's definitely Blackwell's loss. You covering for me was amazing. I don't know how to thank you. Whatever. You tried to cover for me too. You tried to cover tried for me failed. first. I guess we know who the better liar is. Or maybe my lie was the one he wanted to believe. At least Probably Wild true. No idea what really went down with us last night. Fucking Shit true. Pretty wild. Pretty wild. Rachel, that was more than pretty wild. You went absolutely nuts last night. What the hell were you thinking? I was angry. I didn't expect the whole stupid park to go whoosh. But now you're in on it too. Accessory. You didn't think that lighting a motherfucking um, tree on fire I'm in the snitch. middle of a forest <laughs> I'd be way would start a forest fire? Dick Tater David. Bitch, are you dumb or are you stupid? The fuck? 
Oh. Sorry, I'm actually not that mad at her. That's awful. I'm so sorry. You know, not necessarily things. some shit that I would have done, personally. Therapy. But like, you start. Kick back and tell me what's bothering you. That's such a cute position well, to cuddle in. Not gonna lie. One of my favorite positions. Blackwell. I've been booted from school, and I'm not entirely sure what to do about it. You mean how to cope with your feelings? I think it's just the perfect order. No. Blackwell, I mean, David, how to fire. My feelings of intense joy. Uh huh. Do you think you might be taking this a little too well? You tell me. Hades, don't do I'd it. I'd say I'm exceptionally well adjusted. Don't do it. I'd bet my therapist's license that no one's ever called you that before. <laughs> Hades has arrived to the scene. He heard fire. He said fire. Fire. There's this dildo with a mustache who's been dating my mom and now he thinks Buddy. He's moving in with us. My buddy. How do I stop him? Hmm. That's a hard one. I'm not sure there's really anything you can do. I mean, what the hell am I talking buddy. to you for? Just because you can't stop him doesn't so fluffy, mean you don't so fight cuddly. back. The resistance begins now. All right, you're going to need a new nickname to mark your enemy. What have you got? I like step douche. He's a uh, step douche because he's inserting himself where he doesn't belong. Also, he's a douche. Poetic. May I also suggest step ladder? Step ladder. Step ladder. Because he climbs on your mom every night. Ew. And pretty soon they'll be stepping down the aisle. What the hell kind of therapist? Rachel, the fuck is wrong with Sorry. you? It's called shock therapy. Highly controversial. She's such a bitch. Your turn. Your turn. That was actually somewhat therapeutic. Thank you. Oh, it's I didn't. Always a pleasure uh, okay, I would have mentioned the fire place. if I didn't know. And now it's I didn't know I couldn't go back. Tell me all about what it's like being daughter of Arcadia Bay's most famous scumbag. It sucks. Too blunt. Sorry. I do that sometimes. Girl, don't apologize. She literally did the shock therapy thing on you, bitch. I see trees of green, else. red roses of too, and I think to myself, what a wonderful hey, world. Chances are, pretty soon this entire town will be burnt to a smoldering pile of ashes, so, you know, things are really looking up for us. From what I've tasted of desire, I hold with those who favor fire. I feel like I look so old right now. Like, I feel like I look literally so fucking old. I guess I should have been paying attention. That's the one that I really wanted the input on. Do you on. think there's a point when you've been acting so much that you don't even have your own personality anymore? You're just whatever you think other people want you to be. Yes! I think you have a personality. I wasn't talking about me. My dad doesn't really exist. You saw him in Wells' office. The whole thing is a performance. Please don't scratch and me, Hades. Now I'm starting to feel like everything in my life is bullshit. But he's still my dad. How can I make sure I end up like him? We're not like him, bitch. You couldn't be like him even if you wanted to. You're too awesome. The fact that you believe that makes me feel better. I forgot that she dies. Shit. It's time for the play. As if my life didn't have enough drama in it. To love. You know you're never supposed to tell an actor good luck before a show? It's bad luck. How is telling someone good luck bad luck? You're supposed to say, 
break a leg. That's dumb. Hey, I, I was thinking that after the show, maybe we could go do something. Just you and me. Something criminal? Criminally fun. <laughs> I'm in. You still have energy to do things even after you, like, perform? Wait, you forgot your bag. It's for you. Just a little survival kit for your new life on the lamb. Drive safe, Chloe. How did she know? Oh, I guess we, I don't know. This shit's kind of confusing. This shit is too galaxy brain for me. It's the cubicle I was talking about. <laughs> Hello, Junk Shack. Time to check out Rachel Amber's mystery bag. Are you ready, my gay? Ack. I heard you got expelled. Sorry. Yeah, I rolled a one against Wells. Get it? Steph says you're a nerd. One new message. I need- maybe I need my daughter back. Oh. Chloe, Dave is trying to do what he thinks is best. He's such a tool! I didn't like that he asked you to empty your pockets and then you were completely innocent. Chloe, can't you just forget about David for a second? Think about me. Maybe I just need space, okay? Maybe I need my daughter back. Yeah, I wonder where she got the back talk skill from. I really fucking wonder. A bag full of clothes. Rachel Amber okay, Sheik. Try them on! Nothing like an abandoned shack in the middle of a junkyard to make a girl feel like exploring a new wardrobe. How did I know she was gonna say wardrobe? I like the skull. I think the skull is fucking epic. Skull? Cause we just got expelled from school? Okay! Jesus died for our Cynthia's. Oh, she the, she the original e-boy. She the original e-girl. She the original e-girl, they, them. E, they, them, I meant. Okay. No, I meant to choose that one. I meant to select that one. Good wordplay. Thank you. Thank you. I just- I love slam poetry so much. I respect it, thank you. How are you doing, history written by the victor? <gasps> He's at the junkyard. Oh my god. Well, let's go talk to him. I literally, I just love 22 Jump Street so much. Like, you can follow up any slam poetry, any, like, slam poetry, any play on words with That's Jesus so died for our Cynthia's, and it's fucking comedy gold to me. I'm doing fantastic, thanks for asking. Good to know. Is this the first playthrough? Yes, it is. It is. The secret password, man. <laughs> Is the password drugs? <laughs> Get your ass in here. But I'm loving it so far. I'm literally loving this game so far. I think it's the best of the Life is Strange playthroughs that I've done. I've done the original and I've done True Colors and now I'm doing this one. Dude, it smells like piss in here. Shut up. You have a rough night or something? Every night's a rough night. I've got a notebook in the back somewhere. Go get it for me, would you? Jeez, man. I didn't know we were evacuating. Then we'll talk. No, 
I'm fetching things for Frank. How low can I go? Food spell. I guess Frank subscribes to the hiding in plain sight philosophy of drug stashing. Real. Oh my god, that literally fucking works. Because back whenever my mom was a Molly dealer, police came to her house and were like, we need to search this place. And um, she was living with her brother at the time. And her brother was like, no, not unless you have a warrant. And they left. And he went searching throughout the entire fucking place for drugs. Because uh, he knew what she did. And he like tore apart her bedroom. She got home. There were two molly pills on the nightstand that he missed. So apparently it does work. Tempest is going to be awesome. Like, awesomely bad, I mean. It's going to be hilarious. Hey, don't worry about being expelled, okay? Dude, I'm fine. I'm literally fine. <gasps> That's graffiti. Work. Got it. Chloe's drugs. Your mom must have been a great individual, given the people what they need. For real. For real. She's still alive. She's making enchiladas right now. Next time, try Ask Miss Arcadia. Puppies have accidents when they are scared. You have to stop scolding your puppy. Marianne. Thanks, but I don't scold him. Then why is she having accidents? Raising a puppy requires patience. If you cannot control yourself, please look deeply and honestly at whether you're really able to have a dog. What's your fucking problem, lady? I said I don't scold him. Wow, there's no need to swear. I think it's pretty clear now that you do scold her and worse. It's... Wait, Frank is gay with the keyboard smashing? Rachel the therapist would have a field day with this. Salute to your mother. No, for real, for real. Dream about clouds meeting. What age will dog eat steak? <laughs> Pisshead music. Mila Kunis single. Oh, oh, he thinks he has a chance with Mila Kunis. I was watching Black Swan the other day and I forgot Mila Kunis' name and I was like, Mina Kunalis. Mina Kunalingus. Like, what is her name? Cloud Formation Screensaver. Okay, me. Property Insurance Fire Illegal. Oh, he's working out for the Arcadia Bay Fire. Arcadia Bay Forest Watch. Megan Fox single? Yes! We love Megan. We love Megan. We love MGK. How large was the biggest cloud in history? Why won't puppy eat steak? Why won't puppy eat steak? Shit. The mill burned down. Oh. Total massacre. Can't stop thinking about it. <gasps> the puppy mill? I just want to find who started the fire and burn his fucking face. Ball crusher. Three, four, eight at Ezanon.alio. Do you think anybody really has that email? Like through Google? Jeez. That's an expensive dog. Frank, you like the dog? I thought you would. The dog is special, man. Callie's buyer wanted him, and I said, fuck off, keep your 3K. I'm saving him for my buddy Frank. I mean it. Everything you've done for me adds up way more than the 3k don't thank me this is from me to you just let me breed him later i thought dog was a girl i might be wrong frank must be spending hundreds of dollars on this dog <laughs> why won't dog eat steak god damn i love this man Is this what I think it is? 
Ah, shit. I'm in for red. Chloe, 175. Uh, 1,050? Alice. Time to find out what Frank wants to discuss. Wow. That pillow <gasps> is definitely dead. That's so my dog. That is so my dog core. Frank and his BFF. That's adorable. He is feeding the puppy regular food, though. Because Frank finally gave up on the steak. He really- that is such a masculine thing to do. Don't mind if I do. Don't even fucking think about it. Damn. I don't even, like, know what you're talking about, dude. Is this it? Have a seat. Pompadour, huh? That's one badass name for a dog. Pompadour. I thought Pompadour was a girl. <gasps> French for what? Does it mean like tough guy or something? Do I look like I speak fucking French? Okay. So, who was that woman? What woman? The one I saw coming out of your RV. Oh yeah, I meant to introduce you. Her name is Mind Your Own Fucking Business. Back talk. Angel would want to know more. I bet I can convince Frank it's harmless to tell me. Dude, Thank you, I'm Higgins. just curious. What's the big deal? Idiot. I make money by being discreet. I won't sell you out. Frank. You know I hate everyone. Who do you think I'm gonna tell? Come on, Price. I gotta protect my clients. Happy customers are the foundation of a good business. Jeez, God. So, uh, I had this dream the other night about a cloud that swallowed Arcadia Bay. You too? See? We're a lot alike, Frank. We've got shit in common. Sure, I guess. So why are you so hung up on this chick? Frickin' beans. Just hanging out. I'm not. Just hanging with a friend here. A friend I don't know much about. Tell me, Frank. Seeing any girls lately? She makes it sound like so natural. Frank. Talk. And I'll get my mom to make you something special. I don't want like him on what? the desk. Uh, he can stay in my lap, though. Chili of hers. <laughs> Excuse. You got it. The woman you saw. Her name's Sarah. Short Sarah with an E. Causing all kinds of trouble for all sorts of people. Like who? It's a little out of your league, okay? But what kind of trouble is that? Forget about it, Chloe. You shouldn't have opened my mouth. Thanks. For telling me. Whatever. You hear the mill burn down? Yeah. I uh, heard some stuff about it. Crazy. My friend Damon runs the place. He lost a lot of money last night. Money from what? I money thought it was a what? puppy mill, but well, I should have known. He's had a few things going on. I help him out with some of them. Don't drown me in the details, Frank. Lately, he's been doing some stuff that I don't like, but I don't seem to have much leverage with him. <gasps> Little hot dog chew toy. Anyway, you and I have shit to discuss. Is this about the buck seventy-five? What? The money that I owe you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, I, I don't give a shit about that. Is he trying to get with Rachel? You have it? Um, I'll get it to you later. Give me like another week. I don't have enough right now. I wonder if I'll ever get tired of your crap. I mean, you're lucky you're the least of my problems. Open my notebook. Last page. Should be some entries for a kid named Drew. You know him? <laughs> Drew North? Yeah. Is that the kid that was bullying? Oh, shit. That's 
That's a lot of money. Drew runs Oxy for Damon. Apparently, football players eat it like candy. Probably. I guess. But is Drew the guy that was bullying Nathan? Go Bigfoots. Problem is, Drew owes a grant, and he's not answering my calls. You know what's going on with him? He's a douchebag. Uh, he's an unreliable douchebag. No, this is the first time he's done this. Kid's actually smart. Anyway, here's the job. I'm taking you to Blackwell. Go to Drew's room, find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Can you handle that? What's in it for me? Is he gonna yeah, is this gonna pay off course, my debt? But what's in it for me? Idiot, you still owe me. So if I do this, then we're good? That, and I'll do even better. I'll give you a 10% cut of the money. Okay. Yeah, sure. I'll do it. What's the matter? You jumped. It might be a little tough. I, I'm not supposed to be at Blackwell. I... Got expelled. Sorry, I just got really this interested morning. in the story. Congratulations. It's still easier for you to go on campus than for me. If you can't even do this price, a hundred dollars closer to leaving Arcadia Bay with a bit of cash and the truck fixed, Rachel and I could really do it. We could leave for good. Oh, I'll do it. good deal. Breaking Bad. Oh. <laughs> the license plate said B R K B D. Breaking Bad reference. No way. Breaking Bad reference. Dude, this man's better call Saul. Didn't think I'd be back this soon. Well, here goes nothing. That's concrete, baby. Get into the dorms. Back at school yet again. They've got some tents for dressing rooms. What are you up to? I'm here too, actually, running an errand for my dealer. Oh, really? So bad. Come see me when you're done? Yeah, for sure. P.S. I saw that woman that your dad was coming was with coming out of my dealer's RV. What? Apparently she's causing trouble for a lot of people or something. Her name's Sarah? Rachel? I think maybe I prefer not knowing her name. Oh, my bad. No, it's fine. See you soon. Can we talk to her? <gasps> Steph! Hey, Steph. Whoa. Hey, Barb, the elf barbarian. Your shirt looks like the tea leaves they used to tell people's fortunes. How's my future looking? Bright and sunny. Surprised to see me. It's on still a raven that we're I wearing. I just realized that. That text was a rare courtesy, by the way. I don't normally get involved in other people's dumb decisions. A Tricks lost cause. You, because I am the ultimate lost cause. Skipping with Rachel Amber does have an appeal. Well, yeah. So, what are you doing here? Just running an errand? I'm just picking up something from uh, somebody. <laughs> it's for a friend. Now I'm really curious. What are you doing? What's all this stuff? I'm prepping for the Tempest show tonight. I'm the stage manager. Oh, right. Uh, I think I knew that. Honestly, the show's really good. It's worth seeing. I'm sure it is. Obviously, Rachel's fantastic, but everyone else is pretty impressive, too. Yeah, Rachel's you a good to actress. See a totally different side of everyone, especially the guys. Uh, no thanks. Okay. Now you just unconvinced me. 
Why am I not surprised? Yeah, well, good luck with all of that. <laughs> Said Gio. Maybe I'll see you later. Oh, hey, I wanted to ask you something. Shoot. I've been planning to make a move on Rachel, but not if you two were together. Make a move? So, are you? Uh, I mean, that's Rachel's business. Or maybe yours and Rachel's business. But if you feel comfortable telling me... Um, I'm not sure. I'm... <laughs> Hello, Boris GK. I don't know. It's... Just chilling. It's confusing. After this, I'm gonna eat some of my I, mom's I enchiladas. Imagine. You ever wanna talk to me, Chloe? You know you can, right? I'll see you later, Steph. Have fun storming the castle. How are you doing? First time? Yes. <sighs> Just boards, it's fine. I see, I see. Figures. Looks like my options are become a master lock picker or swipe someone's keys. Uh, yeah. What is this guy doing? What are you doing here? Oh, I was Aren't about to ask you the same thing. Home, thinking over What's up, Sakusani? How are you doing? Decisions? Dude, why do you care about my questionable decisions? It offends me. Okay, just find interesting streamer to watch. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Evan just call me yeah, I think I'm pretty interesting. We were just yeah, talking great. about um Evan looks... drugs or er, yeah, drugs and Frank's decision to hide drugs in plain sight. Hey, uh and Evan? how my As mom used to do the same thing right now. Back whenever she was like my age and a Molly dealer. So I, I think I'm pretty concern, interesting. But I want to get this shot at the very exactly least. Right. And I've learned a bit better than last week. Hope you're doing good. I'm doing good. Yeah, I'm I've really doing that great. If I'm passionate about something, it's probably the right thing to care about. For example, I've been trying to get the students and administration interested in forest fire prevention. That is kind of an yeah. topic to focus on. Not to like toot my People own horn so or anything, to pass on responsibility to anyone but I'm just saying like if you're looking for an interesting streamer, like and you've come to the right place. Lives. You see what happened? I guess you were right. <laughs> Looks like you were right. Go, Evan. You're a hero of the people. I know you feel like I do. Oh, this has got a intel about in your stream, things, sure. I guess. Like the but tags? Oh yeah, true, true. Like yeah. Them. Anyway, you're not supposed to be here. You should leave. I see like my favorite, my favorite streamers. And one of them is like, I like Prezzo. And one of his tags is Uncut Gamers Against Cars. And like, Rancid. And I just think it's so funny. Many streamers got one tag or two tags. See, I find like my ultimate favorite stream favorite streamer only has one tag and it's English, which is crazy because he's Estonian. Hey, Samuel. But yeah. Been busy. Always, Chloe Price. I didn't think you'd be returning to these hallowed halls so soon. <laughs> Neither did I. I have the feeling it wasn't uh, the books or bricks of Blackwell that led you back. <laughs> what? You're here for someone. A special someone, yes? True. I'm uh, <laughs> looking for Drew North. Most I like how North it animates like the wind. Only the I got two tags for the languages. That makes sense. That. What are he the languages that you speak? A great heart he has with much love and no room for fear. As I'm French, but I do my stream in English. I, I see, I see, I see. He may be that too. No one. Prezzo's, just um, one thing. a Canadian, but he speaks French. I've got to go, man. Uh, <laughs> it's been real. Be kind to yourself, Chloe Price. Is there a way for me to go back in and just look around for keys? 
books. Squirrel statue. Oh, keys. Bingo. If only those keys were unsupervised. What's Samuel working Maybe on? Maybe he's from Quebec. The sprinklers? That's actually interesting. That's, that's interesting to figure out. I don't know. I mean, I never thought of him as like a Toronto p person just because he doesn't have like the Toronto accent. But still, that's interesting. Okay, what am I gonna do now? Something about the sprinklers. Drew's room definitely isn't this way. I've never been in this part of the world yet. Maybe next year. Maybe How next can I year. get Samuel away from his keys? Such a nice white door. Though, it feels like it's missing something. Doesn't it? Too bad I can't tag it with Samuel standing right there. Okay, how are we gonna get the sprinklers to go off? Right now I'm living in London. I'm so jealous of you. I wish that I could go to London. I need a way to distract Samuel. I live in Austin. So like Yeah, it's interesting. Just the type of people here, because you either get like people who are like Welcome to extremely hell. Republican or people who are like extremely Democrat. Every once in a while, there will be people like me who are like libertarians, but that's like really rare. Are you a multi gamer streamer? Yes, um, I stream Fortnite too sometimes. I'm currently working on streaming the Life is Strange. Series. Samuel's working on the sprinklers. Some damage here might get his um, attention. But yeah, I also stream and like right I've there. streamed Toontown sometimes, The Sims sometimes. Yeah, I noticed that. Yeah, I freaking love Fortnite. So tempting, but Evan will see me for sure. <laughs> and he sounds like he's in the mood to get me mm. in trouble. Hey. Shit. I wanted you to go the I've been other trying way. to get like, more into Minecraft recently possible. though. The other way. Time for a fresh start. I'd rather play Fortnite and more about game go. story content. I guess that makes sense. That makes sense. So tempting, but Evan will see me Come for on. sure. <laughs> I can see that. I can see that for sure. Gotcha. Like Resident Perfect. Evil Cyberpunk 2077. Do you know um, if Cyberpunk is available to play on PC? Because last I heard it was just available on PS5. Or games with decision making. I get that, I get that. I kind of also like respect decision making games more. Now I just have to wait for Samuel to turn on the... <laughs> because like... It's just more interesting. It's more interesting to talk about. Like, whenever I'm playing Fortnite, it's, like, pretty difficult to find something to talk about that's not just Fortnite because all my attention is, like, on, like, getting the kills. 
but yeah. I really see so here's here's a here's a thinker that I want your opinion on. How do you feel about games like Bimbo Land? That are like Sorry, Samuel. I don't know. Look at what Zimbo Land is and tell me like what you think about that as a person All who right. likes decision making Time games. No time like Which one? Zimboland. Bimboland, Zimboland. It's a game where like you can get into like out it's a, kinda like a dress up game, but you get into like outfit fights with people, you can debate people. It's like hey, politics hey, and sir. fashion combined. So you can like get into fashion fights with people, you can you debate on like topics, you, you can like talk about school? politics and stuff like that. It's like a community-based game. Relax. I'm just uh, visiting a friend. I can't. I really can't just let you go in. I'm going inside, dude. I never play, but I will probably try it. I have like some tutorials posted on my YouTube channel. In fact, I think I have to ask you to if like official business a more like a dull dress up game would be like more your style. Not more your style, but it would skip, be your style. I've got to get inside. Maybe if I make him really uncomfortable, he'll feel guilty and let me pass. Watch my official business. Hades! Hades! Let me scare my cat really quick. Chloe, I just have this feeling like you're up to... Wait. You talked me into letting you into the bathroom this morning. And then you tagged the entire freaking place. I think something in my closet that I'm like disapprove I... of. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. I totally did that. Wells raked me over the coals for that. Time to go. Or what? What are you gonna do, Skip? Because unless you're prepared to drag me off. Because of good campus, streamers I've met on Twitch and threads, I could discover many games that I never play in my life. I see, I see. Chloe, enough. This is my job. I discovered Toontown from a streamer. You should try Cyberpunk anyway on PC. I definitely will, because it is a game that really intrigues me. I am so tired of being shit on by high schoolers. You know what? I'm done. I'm done with this stupid rent a cop job. <laughs> just, just do whatever the fuck you want, Chloe. Whoa, skip. But I will try the game that you told me. Yes. I have some clips of it on my channel. Of just playing the game and like talking about it. There are some mini games on there too. That's funny. I've got, I've got reports about how you like one that's kind of like Candy Crush and Visual Blitz, and then Sudoku, and then matching games, and then like a sliding puzzle. Skip really lost it there. How's it going? Have you found it yet? Chill out, man. It's been like five minutes. It's been twenty. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm on it. Hurry up. All right. Time to find Drew's room. Excuse. This game's high on resources. This game's high on resources, Cyberpunk. What do you mean by that? Alright. Which one is Drew's room? Could Elliot be lamer if he tried? Okay, so that's Elliot's room. I think I never see games with high on PC configuration. I see, I see. That makes sense. Yeah. Uh, definitely Drew's room. 
PC requirement, I see. I'm on PC. Or a high figuration. RAM graphic card and else. I understand what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, because my PC is not that good. Like, I would be using, I would be using, like, these headphones right now. If it were for, like, my Bluetooth on, my Bluetooth. Not my sound card, but, like, my Bluetooth card. I don't know what it's called. Good. <laughs> Drew's not here. Fucking so bad. Okay. <laughs> if I were Drew, where would I hide my money? Oh, man. Looks like Drew's dad is having a hard time. Yeah. <laughs> they look so happy. <laughs> Looks like Mikey's been staying here with Drew. I didn't realize Drew was this good at sports. I bet he can't wait to get out of Arcadia Bay. Okay, so Drew has a scholarship. Frank wasn't lying. Looks like Drew sells happy pills to his fellow meatheads. So he's going to University of Washington. Quarterback candy, I love that. Gonna like start Venmoing my friends for quarterback candy. Hey bro, do you have any more happy pills? I'm beat as hell. So I'm gonna take that hit for you last night, right? No one gets my boys girl on my watch, but hook me up, will you? Something just to take the edge off is all I need. So many folks are shit out of luck around here. What an amazing game, son. Aspects. Spent the day at the library again. Computers aren't my thing, you know that, but I'm trying to learn. There's remedial skills class Mikey made me promise to take, so I'm going to do that next. See about learning how to type worth the damn. Never had to type on a fishing boat. Taking me forever to finish this email. Aww. Too bad I lost my release form. I was really looking forward to running all those sweaty laps. Holy shit, Drew. Full athletic scholarship? scholarship. No wonder you're so into football. Oregon State University? I've seen a basketball game from Oregon State the University. Our steak or steak. Drunk, probably. Is the money in there? All right. Guess I have to crack a four digit code. Hmm. I wonder exactly how important 516 is to Drew. 51610. Oh. Oh gosh, why didn't I just apply it? Why did I misclick? Fuck. Damn it. Wrong numbers. Fuck. Okay. Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? No wonder you're so into football. Plenty of possible combinations here. I'm willing to bet it's Mikey's birthday, 1227. Wow, how'd I know? This is kind of fun. Have you played these games? Beyond Two Souls, I haven't. Heavy Rain, I haven't, but I want to. Detroit Become Human, I've seen my favorite wow. streamer play Detroit Become Human, Little and I really liked it, so I might to. play that soon. The Wolf Among Us, I haven't. Batman Telltale Check series, out. I haven't. Batman the Enemy Within, oh, I haven't. Game of Thrones, I haven't. I haven't just because of monetary reasons. Like... My family is like really like strapped for cash right now because um, we have a cat with stomatitis okay. and we're having to have I mean, her back molars removed and 
it's like a really expensive procedure even with the military discount that my dad gets um I have to take her up to like A&M University in order to get it done so that's why um I have a job right now I'm the prime Zimbo of uh I'm like the leader of the community on the game that I mentioned on Zimboland so um yeah there's that so I'm like trying to get a job I tried to get two jobs but I think the issue is that I applied with hey, my like Elamon. regular what? email with like my what personal email which was attached to this twitch account and I think they I did like a search <laughs> for like for the brother, accounts that are connected here, so. I think they did a search for the accounts that are connected to that email and I then they found out that I'm a hot tub streamer so I think that was an issue for them um because apparently if you like because apparently like the because apparently even though like olympic swimming is like the number one watched olympic sport like hot tub streamers like aren't respected for doing like kind of a similar thing um it's like dude like i was a college swimmer like do you like do you think that i would do anything differently like you know what I mean? Like, as a college swimmer, like, the line of, like, being, like, a hot tub streamer is, like, really along the lines, or the job of being a hot tub streamer is really along the lines of, like, the future jobs that you get relating to swimming as, like, a college swimmer. Same thing as, like, a casino mermaid. Like, if I was a casino mermaid, I don't know if they would treat me this way. But, yeah. Doesn't matter. Mikey, get your stuff, let's move. True. Relax. That's part of why I'm trying to like stream every day and also work on YouTube videos or Zimboland so that I can like Shit. You're making me you know about help provide for my own needs. Who the hell is that? No. So that my parents don't Stay have to worry about like financially supporting me throughout the summer Whatever until I go back to school in the fall the and they can help take care of like my cat and stuff like that. You know what's going on? Damon, you shouldn't have come here. School's not the place for this. Really? Where is the place to collect my fucking money? Shit. I told you, I don't have it. Yeah, I know Tells what you see. Yeah, man. yeah. Nobody wants to get high right now. But look, it's spring season. We just started two a day. Those are gonna kill us. I'll be able Seems to Seems like all a good plan, yeah. Out. I'm like, Great. I'm trying my best. A grand. Where is it? I said I don't have it right now. I heard about your dad's job, by the way. Tough time. Yeah. Not the minister. Mean a lot to him right now. Where's my money, Drew? I lost my I job a few months ago. I can't just take money I'm sorry to hear that. My, my brother Drew, also just that? lost his job. I'm just, uh, Where is it? Uh, um, just give me one, uh, I think I think my brother's about to go to rehab too. Hopefully, because he really needs to go to rehab. No one steals from me. Fuck. I'll stay with Mikey. Let me go. No. Your brother said to stay inside. It'll be okay, Mikey. It'll be okay. Damn, you were one tough kid. It was emotionally hard. I bet. I bet. Yeah. What about I bet. Good luck running on that knee now. Oh. Bye bye football. <coughs> well, I'm done. Get my money. Or maybe it'll be your little brother I talk to next. See you soon. Uh, uh, Drew! It's, it's okay. I'm okay. Little brother. Because the company got financial issues. If you get laid off, can't you like apply Thank for you. unemployment? Do they have unemployment Thank where you are? 
So I removed everyone. That sucks. I'm gonna keep the money. I, I didn't do anything. You kept my brother safe. Drew? Yeah. You well, that's good. Hospital. That's good that you can get unemployment. At <sighs> least. Don't tell anyone about this, okay? Yeah. No. No way. What? Um. What do you mean by that? I'm still PA anyway. <sighs> about Damon? I don't know. <sighs> One day at a time. I hear you. I'm still paying anyway. What do you mean? I'm a little lost, sorry. I'm like a little bit like slow, not gonna lie. I mean, I still receive my salary. I see, I see. You're still paid anyway, I see. Well, that's good, that's good. The forest fire of Arcadia Bay still raging on. for the Tempest showing. Oh yeah, we're going to see Rachel. This is seeming like a good this day end to the episode. So At least I can talk to Rachel now. If I can find her back here. We held on to Mikey, he told me it meant a lot to him. Yeah, well I'm sure the money would have meant a lot to Drew and to Damon. Swim poster. Go otters go. <gasps> Water polo Drew seems to be the captain of every Blackwell sport. Man. Whoa. I hope he's okay. Yeah, well, with water polo with that knee, he's not going to be able to play water polo because I'll tell you with the egg beater kick, the egg beater kick heavily relies on the knees. If your job is redundant, you're paid depending about what you've done, on, what you've got on your contract. I see. So I'm going to be paid for six months. Well, that's good. That's good. Seaside, Culmination, Willow Creek, Engelbart. Surf Pines, Astoria, Olney. Hey, Dana. Her makeup is did so pretty. Did Doug dig David's garden? Or did David dig Doug's? Did Doug dig How David's garden? Or did In the meantime, I stream Doug every day David's and I do my YouTube channel as well. Okay, okay. I see, I see. Rachel? I'm working on um, a YouTube video for promoting my favorite Barbie movie, which is like the most, to be honest, I prefer the American accent. Oh, that's so sweet. Um, But I'm promoting, uh, or I'm still working on my video about the most underrated Barbie movie of all time called Barbie Fairy Toby and Magic of the Rainbow. I think it's gonna be epic. British accent is different, but it's fine. I often find that like British accents are hard to understand and same thing with New Zealand accents, but not with like Australian accents. Whatever that was, it was shady as shit. 
I need to find whatever Victoria slipped into that drink. Muscle relaxers? Before your tea gets... <sighs> what are you doing here? This area is for cast and crew only. Here for Rachel. I'm here to support Rachel. How nice. I want to make sure she's relaxed before the show. <sighs> Whatever. Oh, Rachel Amber, it was customary among the thespians of ancient Greece for the understudy to offer hot tea to the lead actress on opening night. As a way of showing appreciation for her tutelage, it is in that spirit that I offer you- Have you played all the Life is Strange? I have not. I haven't played- I've played the original, and I've played Life is Strange yeah. True Colors. Um, I've played them like all out of order. Um, so I'm playing this one and then I'm gonna play Life is Strange 2. Wait up, Rachel. Bitch, dosed your tea. Excuse me? How dare you? Victoria, could this possibly be true? Uh, of course not. A dropout Chloe is clearly directing her misplaced anger at me. I'm sorry your life is a mess, but it's not my fault, okay? Hmm. Chloe. Victoria is my friend. That's fine. This one is good she too. I really like this one so far. And she should explain the. And she should explain the muscle relaxers I found. Victoria, she does kind of have a point. What are you doing with these? What? I don't like true colors. I didn't really like it that much. I felt like the main character was like too cringy, but like I still respected it. Oh, right. And I just like the DLC about it. I see, I see. It's really useless and boring. Yeah, the only DLC that I saw was like, um, the outfit changes. I did like the scene where it was like, um, the Ren Fair kind of thing that was going on for the kid Ethan. So happy. Ugh, whatever. If you're done accusing me of things, I'll just be on my way. Bitches. <laughs> wow. Yeah, true colors have the uh, option. All in a day. Yeah. And this. All my strange true colors, the like Renfair thing that I was talking about, and then also okay. they had the uh, DLC for um, the outfits that Alex much. could change into. How did I know you were going to pick that one? I guess Prospera knows all. Sweet honey, we're ruined. The show is ruined. That was quick. My dear young artists, a misfortune most unkind has befallen us. Juliet is waylaid. That infernal inferno is the culprit, closing down the roads and robbing us of our aerial. Would that she could but manifest on her master's whim as a true spirit. Alas, devoid of an understudy, the situation is a dire one indeed. I'm afraid we may have to cancel. Truly, we are a cursed lot. Even my prodigious imagination cannot conceive of a worse turn of fate. <gasps> Touche. Okay, I don't remember every detail about it. Me neither. What? Me neither. Uh, uh, oh, no. Mr. Keaton. No. Chloe could step in for Juliet. No fucking chance. At least until the road's clear. The romantic. She's the right fit for Juliet's costume. She is indeed. Tell me, my dear, have you ever acted before? 
Hell no. She's being modest. We play improv games all the time. And she's fantastic at it. My dear, what if I told you that the entire fate of the production rests upon your slender Not shoulders? Not her slender shoulders. I'd say you're super fucked. Chloe, please. For me. Wait, she kind of looks badass. She's the Raven. I can't believe. Have you ever played into this. Resident Evil? I have not. I have not played Resident Evil. I seriously have to memorize all of this. Thanks, Rachel. All hail, great mistress! I come to answer thy best pleasure. I boarded the king's ship in every cabin. I flamed amazement, the fire and cracks of sulfurous roaring. The most mighty Neptune seemed to besiege and make his bold waves tremble. Not a soul, the king's son, Ferdinand, was the first man that leaped, cried, Hell is empty and all the devils are here. Not a hair perished, and as thou badst, badst me, badst me, I have dispersed them about the Isle of Troops. Is there more to toil? Let me remember thee what thou hast promised. My liberty. That's my noble mistress. And you're done. You should try. I'm gonna finish Resident Evil 6 next, next week, I guess. That's interesting. That's interesting. I've seen that Resident Evil has a TV show. I think my sister was really into that, but I don't know if she's ever played. Chloe, the show is starting. We got great seats. Where are you? Oh, you'll see. I just talked to Damon. He said he had to come down hard. Didn't see you. What happened? Did you find the money? Price was the money. This is serious. Quit fucking around unless you're dead. Reply. Let's meet tomorrow. Have answers. <gasps> oh, we should have given the money to Damon. Yeah, TV series, but they made one season, I guess. I don't know if they're gonna uh, make more. I'm gonna look one more time. Seriously, have to all hail, all great mistress! This? I come to answer thy best Dang. pleasure. I boarded the king's ship in every cabin. I flamed amazement. The fire and cracks of sulfur roaring. The most mighty Neptune seemed to besiege and make his bold waves tremble. Not a soul, the king's son Ferdinand. Was the first man that leaped, cried, hell is empty, all the devils are here. Not a hair perished. And as thou badst me, I have disappeared, dispersed them about the Isle of Troops. Is there more to toil? Let me remember thee what thou hast promised. My liberty, that's my noble mistress. It wasn't great to be honest as far as I heard. I didn't really hear how it was, honestly. <sighs> Looks like I'm late. As usual. I don't know if it's gonna make me recite these lines. Bountiful fortune hath mine enemies brought to the shore. Here, see the movies are great. I didn't know that there were movies. Thou art inclined to sleep. Tis a good dullness, and give it way. I know thou canst not choose. Come away, servant. Come. Ah, shit. I'm on. You. I am ready now. Get up there. Approach, my Ariel. Come. Damn it. No problem. I've got this. I just walk to Rachel and say my line. Mistress, I uh, I come to answer thy best pleasure. Most fearless, generous spirit, hast thou performed to point the tempest that I bade thee? I boarded the king's ship. I boarded the king's ship. In every cabin, 
I flamed amazement. The fire and cracks of sulfurous roaring, the most mighty Neptune seemed to besiege and make his bold waves uh, tremble. My brave spirit, who was so firm, so constant, that this coil would not infect his reason. Uh, not a soul. Anyway, I'm the gonna follow you because I like your personality. Thank Ferdinand you, thank you. Was the first man that leaped from his ship, and I don't really know a whole lot about my personality. I think I'm an INFP T. Hell is empty. Cried, uh, hell is empty, and all the devils are here. Yes. But are they, Ariel, safe? All right. I guess this is when I'm supposed to walk somewhere. Not a hair perish, and uh, as thou baddest me, I have dispersed them about the aisle in troops. Bravo. Ariel, thy charge exactly is performed, but there's more work. More toil? Is there more toil? Sure, no problem, thank you. Let thank me you. remember thee what thou hast promised. How now? What is't thou canst demand? Liberty. My liberty. Indeed. Thy liberty? I will Nay, see you playing Cyberpunk soon then. True, true. Not grant. That, that's not her line. Is it? What's going on? I mean, not only this game's, of course, true. But thou but hast promised. Thou assured my freedom. Didn't thou? I never said how dearly I hold thee. My habit's been to keep my soul well draped. Most loyal spirit, companion, and friend, is acting in my service not replete with excitement, amusement, and delight? Of course, mistress. Most truly, it is so. Mr. Keith, they're way off shrimp. It's magical. I don't think any real theater wish you to be teacher would be like, it's magical. Excitement isn't happiness. Excitement's a mere counterfeit of bliss. These storms and these adventures, I prefer to know thou still cared for my plainest self. I have thee in my grasp. I will not bend. I will not see thee flying forth alone. The envy would be more than I could bear. So come with me. So come with me. Is that not in thy power? Spirit, take my hands. Most faithful friend. For but a little longer I be seen. <laughs> the gasps from the audience. Continue in thy service to my schemes, and when they are complete, I swear to thee, we shall fly beyond this isle. The corners of the world are mere prologue. I'll seek to make thy happiness so great that e'en the name of liberty is forgot. What sayest thou to my most hopeful wish? Oh my god, yes! <sighs> yes. I am most pleased. Your duty done for now. So go forth hence with haste. I've work to do. You crushed it. So good. You're a born thespian, my dear. <laughs> I'll be chasing you down next year. And the ending is absolutely transformative. I am humbled. <sighs> Thanks. Me when I'm doing react content, absolutely transformative. Shake it off. 
Come on. We'll visit Caliban, my slave. Tis a villain, sir. I do not love to look on. He does make our fire, fetch in our wood. What ho? Slave! Caliban! Come forth, I say! On! Uh, mm. As wicked do, as e'er my mother brushed. Thou poisonous slave, got by the devil himself. Filth as thou art, I have lodged thee in mine own cell. Till thou didst seek to violate the honor of my child. I think her makeup's real interesting. Shit. He's crying. Fetch us in fuel and be quick. So, slave, hence. <gasps> oh my god. The murmurs. Where should this music be? In the air? Or the earth? Oh, thank God. This play is super intense. What is it? A spirit? It carries a brave form, but it is a spirit. No wench. It eats and sleeps and hath such senses as we have. I will resist such Wench. entertainment. Put thy sword up, traitor. Do you love me? Oh heaven, oh earth, bear witness to this sound. I beyond all limit of what else in the world do love, prize. I love how she's still in the costume. His tears run down his beard like winter's drops from eaves of reeds. Go release them, Ariel. My charms I'll break. Their senses I'll restore. And Do you think anybody in the audience sense. noticed the difference in actresses for the little raven now creature? My charms are all overthrown. And what strength I have mine own. Pray, release me from my bands with the help of your good hands. So I said, Anne, what do you mean? I mean, not only like the games that you suggested, are we talking about your chat messages, question mark? Sorry, I thought you were talking to me. Oh. Oh, no, sorry. I uh, Sorry, I said, I wonder if anybody in the audience, like anybody in the audience in the game noticed the difference between uh, Chloe and the other girl who played the Raven. Sorry if I just like made everybody's ears hurt with that. I didn't know I was so close to the microphone. Dear, 
what if I told you that the entire fate of our production rests upon your slender shoulders? <laughs> Never had an experience. Oh, like them walking back home. Yeah, right? You know, you. Like, seriously. I love nights after a show. <laughs> Is it always like this? Oh, totally. It's such a high. No more nerves, just the adrenaline. So, first timer, are you proud of yourself? You were literally perfect tonight. I was blown away. I'm so worried about I'm things. I'm happy, but I'm still worried about Mikey and Drew and where I'm going tonight and all of that. <sighs> You've gone through so much shit today. Right now is pretty good. Okay, the whole show was good. I admit it. Yeah. <laughs> it's in her. It's she's in her iconic fit. Her missing poster fit. Hold her hand. They're so cute together. Let's leave. For real. For real. You said you wanted to skip town and never look back. Like I said last night, let's do it. <laughs> I know. What is so bad about this town that they want to skip town? Like, what is so bad about Arcadia Bay? That was. Don't say it was. You go to an art school, bro. Like, what are you. Like, what is the issue? Yeah, but. Like. Eventually. Let's go now. Didn't we already agree on stage? We can't just. <laughs> Why not? Um... Parents? I know our parents have been shitty, but we can't just leave them. That doesn't sound like Chloe Price. My mom needs me. I'm the only one my mom has left. You have too bad she said true, true. You're right. What am I saying? She's got David now. Middle of nowhere. How far could we possibly get without a car? I love I this town, except for the town. fact that the town is also dead. Could. Well, can you or can't you? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. It's not like I do this all the time. You'll figure it out. But you don't even know what shape it's in. I don't need to, because I know you, and I know what you're capable of. Rachel is just like a master manipulator. In other words, we've got transportation covered. <sighs> okay, fine, you win. Fine then, drama queen. Where are we going? <laughs> you tell me. What uniquely twisted location? Yeah, true, but everyone knows each other. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> uh, the open road. I'm feeling like an indefinitely long road trip. That sounds like the greatest idea anyone's ever thought of. You and me. No crime, that's true, except for like the drug deals and like Drew getting beaten by the drug dealer. We'll find a different beach to walk along and watch the sun go down. And one day, you'll be at a gas station fixing the brakes, and some guy with no shirt on will come up. Yeah, okay. He'll be like, that's so hot that you know about cars. And I'll say, back off. She's with me. You're full of shit. <laughs> yeah. I love this time of night. <laughs> Don't you just feel like everything's possible? <laughs> Rachel, stop. If you don't mean this, it's 
It's just making me feel like shit that this life you're describing isn't going to happen. For fuck's sake! I've never been more serious in my life. <laughs> These two are troublemakers. <sighs> Chloe, what would it take to convince you? <gasps> a tattoo! Give me a promise in ink. Like a contract? No. What are we writing? Some graffiti stuff? A star. This is temporary. The deal is, you get it done for real. Then, I'll believe you. I haven't seen many women play cyberpunk. Play oh, cyberpunk. that's a good point. That's a very good point. Really? More Call of Duty. I see, I see. I see a lot of women playing League of Legends. What yeah. is this? Ash. It's obviously a sign. So? What do you say? Let's go sneak some clothes and stuff from my house. For you or for me? I gotta say, my clothes look damn good on you. Cool. Let's do it. And then we'll get the hell out of Arcadia Bay. Fuck yes. Look at them go. James Amber as your district attorney. Integrity. Honesty, loyalty. That's her house and she wants to leave. What the fuck is wrong with her? Oh my god, their plan has been foiled. Rose, Rachel's home. And she um, brought her new friend. Our star returns. You're just in time. Aw, star. Dinner's almost ready. Chloe, was it? Have you played The Last of Us? I have not. Nailed it. I must have been pretty memorable. You were. I get the sense that you're used to making an impression. Rachel, honey, you were resplendent tonight. Thanks. Chloe, you must join us for dinner tonight. Uh, she must? God, I okay. Must? Of course. I made chicken a la king. I'm sure you I've seen the series, though. Appetite. Just leaving. Thanks, but I, I was just gonna stop in for a sec and then bounce. Oh, did you have other dinner plans? Dinner plans? I always thought dinner was something that just sort of happens. Chloe. Yeah, great, I isn't it? Yes, it's so good. I like the scene with the giraffe. Best this morning, but with you and Rachel becoming such fast friends, I insist you join us for dinner. Don't you agree, Rachel? Yes. Of course. Chloe, would you join us for dinner, please? Uh, of course. Great. I just need to wash off, then I'll be right down. Don't be long. In the meantime, perhaps you can help me with the table, Chloe? Sure thing, <laughs> Mrs. Amber. Okay, 
I'm gonna go pack. After dinner, we can make our break. You cool down here? Yeah, the final episode. Yeah, I can't wait for more. Just hurry back. I don't know how long I can keep this up. Try doing it your whole life. And Chloe, we just need to make it through dinner. Try not to say anything that, you know, that I would normally say. Exactly. Just some quality time with the Ambers. What could possibly go wrong? I guess I'll just talk to them. Before Hi, Joel Amber. kills every firefly. Chloe. I guess. I don't really remember that it that well. So, you're a district attorney, huh? I'm your district attorney. Oh, you kind of so did spoil, I though. call you if I'm ever district arrested. What would you be arrested for? It was a joke. Not a good one. Clearly. Gotta go. Duty calls. <laughs> good chat, Mr. Amber. Mm-hmm. Her parents aren't even that bad, like... The hey cat's about there, to scratch Mrs. my monitor. Amber. Chloe, I'm so glad you're joining us tonight. You borrowed that shirt from Rachel. We call it the Rorschach shirt. What Rorschach. I always pronounce it Rashasha. A skull. I uh, definitely see a skull. Interesting. Well, wash it before you bring it back. So, you putting me to work or what? Yes. If you could please take four plates from the cupboard and set them on the table. Uh, what if I can't? Excuse me? You said if I could. Never mind. You're a riot, Chloe. All right, Chloe. You've set the table without ruining someone's marriage before. Peace. Peace and cake. Anyway, gonna try to no sleep. Skeletons. Glad to discover your channel. Hope to see Lots you once you're gonna be online. Though. Oh, thank you. Thank you for joining me. I really appreciated our time together. But I hope you get some good rest. Chloe, Justin Williams' mom just called me. Were you in the play tonight? I would have liked to see that. Kind of just happened. I know it was last minute. I'm glad you're doing well. It would be nice to see you tonight. Are you coming home? Please, Chloe, I miss you. Oh my gosh. Glasses. Damn. The Ambers are fancy as shit. How I'm trying to be. Never realized that getting drunk could be so complicated. Improve. Literal. Hades, what are you doing, buddy? Solved it. Yes, Chloe? Plates? Check. Anything else? Hades, Actually, stop doing that. could you be a dear and ask Mr. Amber what he'd like to drink with dinner? I will be a dear. Talking the oh my god, original Life is Strange like reference? I'll be a dear. And scumbag, I should be fine. Something else? What's your vice, Mr. Amber? I'm sorry? 
Your wife wants to know what kind of drink you're having. Ah, let's say sherry. Okay. One, two, three, sherry. Comical. No, <laughs> damn. Maybe you can help me. Understand. These two have no sense of humor. I'll give it a shot. Rose and I, we worried about Rachel. Yesterday was so unlike her. What do you suppose is going on? Besides me? Besides all my bad behavior rubbing off on her, you mean? Hmm. Another joke. You tell me. It seemed like you and Wells were happy to believe that this morning. Yeah, because it wasn't even my motherfucking fault. Like play into our expectations. In my experience, that's a tactic people use to cover for someone else. Rachel is her own person. She's responsible for her actions. I'd be lying if I said I didn't have concerns. Okay, damn, he's like kind of blaming us. Low-key victim blaming. Now as she navigates the choppy waters. And he doesn't even know that she started the fucking forest fire. Uh, thanks. Oh, I guess we're we have to speak. Speak. Sherry. The boss man would like a sherry. Thank you. The glasses are in the china cabinet. You can place one at his setting. How am I supposed to get to China? <laughs> <laughs> Kidding. <laughs> it's the fancy looking cabinet. The one that's open? You got it. This is so bourgeois. It's the triangle shape one. Basic shapes. <laughs> now you're speaking my language. I want sherry, but instead I got truly. God damn. Okay, what next? Yes, Chloe? What else? <laughs> Feel like I'm getting good at this. Only one last step. As our guest, you may do the honor of lighting the candles. The lighter is in the- It's cool. I've got my own. Oh. You never oh. know when you'll need to light a candle. Right? Kind of real. A paragon of preparedness. Thanks. Cat reveal? Thank you. Time to light some candles and press this joint up a bit. Hey, bees. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. I'm getting you. Both of them ran away from me. Both of them ran away from me. So, I don't know. It's a tragedy. Well, now she's back. Lucky. Lucky. Baby. She might jump up on me. One of them might jump up on me. Okay, what were we gonna do? Light the candles. Lucky! The Amber family and fire. What could possibly go wrong? Oh, 
Oh, they're both running away from me. I just want, this is like the one time where I want a, like one of them to jump up on me. But we got two black cats in here. This is their little safe space because um, so, we didn't adopt them. My brother did, but we had to take them back from him. So now they both live in my rooms. Sag realness, Sag realness. What about that fire? <laughs> Dinner's really good, Mom. Thank you, Rachel. <laughs> the way the fire spreads so fast, I've never heard of anything like it. Wait, let me let me move my camera. Here we go. It's strange <laughs> life, you know. Surreal. It'd be pretty strange. <gasps> what does that mean? I don't know. You tell me. Cause you're the DA, of course. Just cause you're the DA. It's certainly troubling. The latest report from the commissioner's office suggests arson. Arson. Why would anyone do that? Any number of reasons. With everything going on in the world today. Damn. This dinner awkward as fuck. I cannot imagine how difficult these last few years have been for you, Chloe. Now that you and Rachel have become friends, I want you to know that our home is always open to you. Cool. Thanks. Well said, dear. It's imperative in such troubled times as these that we remember what is most important to us. Thanks. Family's not merely a gift. It is a responsibility. As such, those we love must be cared for and never, ever taken for granted. Oh, that's rich coming from you. Rachel may have to take it, but I don't. I'm going to turn his daughter and wife against him at his own dinner table. God damn. I'm not sure I agree, James. Oh, I thought you of all people would be grateful for Gratitude, how privileged. Me, gratitude is just one more way privileged people tell the unprivileged that they should be happy with what they have. True. That's an excellent point, Chloe. We Fucking must true. Be sensitive to the way our privileges shape our perspectives. Well said, Mom. Still, there must be some room for personal responsibility. I'm sure you agree, Chloe. Um. Responsible like my dad? I don't know. He's super responsible. He always drove under the speed limit. Then one day, a truck came along and turned him into a super responsible pancake. See? This is why it's so important to invite diverse voices to converse with one another. <laughs> it's absolutely stimulating. She looks crazy. Just her face looks so, like, robotic. Since you have answers for everything, Chloe... Perhaps you'd like to enlighten us with some of your hard-earned wisdom about the world. Sure. I believe that we should look closely at everyone, especially the people in power, to see what secrets they're hiding. Very well articulated, Chloe. I am consistently She's such an optimist. Where your generation is. is this toxic positivity? Is an excellent articulator. Excuse me, dear, but if this is what passes for politically aware these days, we're in serious trouble. James, that's unfair and also rude to Chloe. No, I don't believe it is. It seems clear that these points Chloe is making are merely veiled attacks on me. Yeah, because you're fucking cheating on your wife, bitch. 1%. I'm sorry. I know it must be hard for you to relate to the working class. Maybe you should give me more chores to do so you can have a nice dinner without me. Chloe, I don't think that's fair. We've shown you nothing but kindness since you've arrived. I must agree. 
So I'm guessing this was not the best option. I bet these microaggressions are real useful for keeping people in line. Convicts, your wife, your daughter. Don't worry, Mr. Amber. I can tell that my progressive attitude is not. The light candles is still in her hand. I'll see myself out. James, Chloe is right. You owe her an apology. I owe her no such thing. I believe she is willfully acting belligerently, just as she did this morning. It is how people like her respond to adversity. People like her? So we're profiling now? This is what eight months in the DA's office is talking about. I resent Damn. that. My office is committed to fair and equitable treatment. Yes, I've read the press releases. Excuse me? Are you calling- Oh, now we started an argument. Rachel! I can't sit here and listen to this bullshit anymore. Rachel! Stop it, Dad. You're a hypocrite. Okay? I know. You lying, cheating, piece of shit, motherfucker. Excuse me? We saw you yesterday at the Overlook. James? Kissing that woman. James. Rachel? Honey, whatever you saw or think you saw, I know it's hard. This is difficult. This is difficult. Think we saw? Think we saw? Are you trying to gaslight us? There's no thinking involved. We saw you locking lips with some other woman. Best part Excuse. is, she and I used the same drug dealer. <gasps> you are not welcome here or around my daughter any longer. I know exactly what kind of person you are from the moment I saw you. And I let my wife's compassion get the better of me. Oh? What kind of person is a that? A delinquent. A broken girl from a broken home. That's enough, James. I will not have you continue to speak to her like this. Damn, what's going on with Rachel? What's Rachel gonna do? Is she gonna s Oh, I knew it! I fucking knew it! She's gonna light it on fire. She's gonna light her fucking house on fire. Why can't you just tell me the fucking truth? Stop lying. Stop being a politician for one fucking minute. Can't you just be my dad? She has a point. She has a point. That woman you saw. That wasn't. What? But why? And why was he trying to gaslight us anyway? Like, what the fuck? He was still trying to be like, I don't know what you think you saw. Oh, he feels bad. Drew owed a hundred and fifty dollars. Collecting names of the lovers that went wrong. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna play this again. And like make the correct decisions this time. Poor Joyce. Bro, she had a PC in her room and she still decided to like run away. What the fuck? Oh, 
Are they dating? It's Rachel's mom. wonder most people took the blame for Rachel I wish that I hadn't though you emptied your pockets at David's request most people did you stayed with Mikey most people did we asked Rachel to get a tattoo which is what like literally nobody did What do we do? What are we gonna do? 